Okay. Show me. Hi there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the Dutch Sea Channel for another episode in my Airplanes Sunday series. And I've got the Dynam Pri Primo, 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 uh, whatever you want, uh, out for a uh, maiden flight. Uh, I've got a very small and bumpy, wet, soggy field over here. Uh, most planes would not be able to take off from this field. Actually, I have tried uh, taking off with my um, Jurafly Tundra on this, from this field. That didn't work out. It uh, kept toppling over. So, um, the test of tests, I guess, for this uh, plane. Let's see if we can uh, get it into the air from this bumpy field. Here we go. Ik heb geen idee of je ook dit gras kan, kan rijden hoor. Ja, ah, die wielen zijn redelijk groot. Nou, we zullen eens even kijken. Beter op pad houden. Dit moet kunnen. Ja, 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 ja. Ja, ik gedaan. Alles doet wat het moet doen. Okay, as you can see, we are up and away with the Dynam Prime Primo. Primo, Primo, whatever. And uh, I was taking off from a very rough patch of uh, grass here. Um, I don't think a lot of airplanes would have been able to get off of this grassy field. I'm flying half stick, 50% throttle. At which the plane has a decent speed, as you can hopefully see against the white sky over here. It is very easy to fly, as it should be. It's a trainer, so these kinds of planes should be very easy to fly. Uh, there is no wind to speak of, by the way, as you can uh, probably hear from my narration. It is a super easy plane to fly. Again, it should be. Okay, rudder, yeah, rudder has a nice amount of authority. I have not been taken off guard by uh, any of the throws. It's not touchy in any sense. Now, uh, you probably can't hear the plane. Um, it's pretty smooth, but again, uh, this is a semi bull nose propeller. Uh, so the, the propeller is a little noisy. A little. Of course, you can uh, opt to uh, replace that propeller by an APC style of propeller. Um, I took off with half flaps. Which worked out just fine. Uh, the plane is uh, very visible, to me at least. I'm not sure what it looks like to you. 
But uh, white plane, white backdrop, could have been a problem, but uh, not really. I have added some striping to the bottom of the wing. Blue stripes. No idea if that's visible to you. Oh yeah, and I am flying it slightly higher up than I would normally do because there are people over here walking all over the place. So for safety's sake. Okay, right now I am at around 70% throttle. Yeah, and the plane sure is faster this way. Not a whole lot though, which was uh, to be expected, I think. Oh well, actually, huh, it's pretty fast. Huh. Okay, the roll rate is uh, very slow. <laughs> very slow. Yep. Okay, so I haven't done any trimming by the way, not at all. Of course I did make sure all control surfaces will level, but uh, again, no trimming needed. Cool stuff man, this plane works out well so far. It has a nice air presence as well. Cool stuff. Okay, I'm gonna apply full flaps now. Um, and the plane then balloons all over the place. So yeah, uh, with full flaps you do want to add a little elevator down. Uh, actually, I didn't really like full flaps all that much. I think I'll limit the throw of the, the flaps a little. At full flaps they are kind of like uh, 90 degrees down. Which, uh, and it uh, got uh, a bit uh, stally and stuff. Okay, I'm at half flaps now and I'm gonna do a mock landing. Oh, I'm far too high up. Okay, yeah, even at half flaps, half flaps actually looks to be enough for landings. It slows right down, as you can hopefully see. Again, I'm doing a few mock landings to see what the plane behaves like. I don't have a lot of room over here. I'll have to start out a little lower. Okay, throttle back to uh, 25%. Bring it down. No, still far too much speed. Okay. And even at lower speeds, it's very controllable, which is of course nice. Okay. Damn. It's hard to, uh, it uh, retains a lot of speed in landings, more than I had expected. Okay, let's try that again.
<laughs> Ooh, scary. Okay, I'll have to get rid of even more speed. Hot damn, a car! Damn it! Okay, I'm uh, at uh, zero throttle now. Okay, that wasn't the most beautiful landing. Yeah, got to get uh, used to uh, any plane. But uh, actually it was kind of a good test of the plane this way. To see if the landing gear held up. And it did. Okay, so this is what my flaps look like. Uh, the way I uh, took off and landed. And this is full flaps. Yeah, I'm not sure. I didn't really like the feel of the airplane at full flaps. Okay, we got it down in one piece. Successful maiden. Next time we'll do a better landing with a slightly bigger field probably. But uh, worked out very, very nice. Okay, well, um, if you are not surprised yet, please do. Hope the video was entertaining and or informative and hope to see you back in another video. Bye bye.